All right, well, I'd like to bring a little bit of seriousness back into this evening. Um, this, what, what we're about to do, this is all for my brother Caleb. And you know, I had so many thoughts about Caleb, with him being my only younger sibling. Uh, we went through a lot together, we lived together up at the U of A, and so I thought, how can I express all these feelings I have for him? And I thought there was nothing better than through the majesty of song. And so, it was a gloomy Sunday afternoon, and my heart was feeling <coughs> reflective. And so, I penned the lyrics to this song that I have entitled, Ode to Caleb. <laughs> supposed to wear. From lipstick and dresses to bras and thongs, he's worn too many things that are just plain wrong. His uniqueness was a bit difficult for the family to bear. Yeah. Caleb, Caleb, you're screwed. <laughs> Unless you finally learn how you can act like you're a dude. It's time. your obsession with wearing ladies shoes he's got an obsession with ladies shoes <laughs> blonde on top and red on the chin his pale complexion is a disease of the skin it might seem creepy but that's just the way he is and sure he's had a few nice moles these little pets that continue to grow and when it comes to plucking nipple hair that boy's a whiz <laughs> So to our surprise and our delight, a few years back he called mom and dad one night and said, believe it or not, there's a girl that's interested in him. <laughs> Is she obese or anorexic, a little slow or just dyslexic? Were the natural questions. Our perception you can tell was quite grim. Nope. She's not. She's Korean. But we were sure that with some time this girl would be a fleeing. I guess that there must be some better qualities in him than these defects we see. There's so many defects that we see. His social skills need a little work. Wake him up on the couch sleep and then he goes berserk. His natural functions just seem a little extra crass. From his body odor that could knock a cow over, to his morning breath that could make a drunk sober, to his putrefying, horrifying, toe-curling, room-clearing gas. Clara! Good luck! Living with our little bro who we think is a schmuck. Clara! know how to live with a dog in the house, then we're sure that you'll get by. Oh, yes, we're sure that you'll get by. Yes, we're sure that you'll get by. Just kidding, Clara. 